Hello everybody, I am Bretman19 and welcome to episode number 29 of our Russian campaign, Season 2 of Empire Total War. Last time we detailed our plan to attack Poland and also finished off Hessen as far as just taking him on in one battle and showing him he really doesn't have the ability to fight me. And we pieced him out, so we worked with that. So let's go ahead in the term and then, uh, you know, we'll see as things get there. Yeah, we've got some troops getting to some positions, that's what they're supposed to do. And, uh, yeah, so our, our battle plan is really simple. We're going to attack him from all directions, <laughs> except for one. We're going to hold, hold him on one direction and I'm going to hopefully get to utilize that, uh, to make it where as he gets to be more bankrupt and he gets more war weariness, he'll start to lose, you know, he'll start to lose territories to potential allies like Prussia and maybe even Austria. I would love for Austria to reform. I don't necessarily want all of Germany. I really just want like the eastern half. Like I want Poland and there is the a east. port in this region that has not yet been developed. So that's kind of what I'm hoping will get to happen. Um, but yeah, you know, we really want to just come come down here to Königsberg. I don't even want West Prussia. Königsberg's great. Um, it's in another army over here. Then to Warsaw, so Minsk, Vilnius, Warsaw. This other army is going to come up to Laval. I'm going to have another army go from Klausenberg to Hungary. This guy is going to come up from, you know, Croatia side. So that's pretty much just kind of how we're moving. I think, you know, we're just getting our guys where we need them to be, though. Uh, you are helping me with that, and I appreciate it, honestly. Yeah, Finland's going to take a little while. You're 100% up here. Natural causes for another missionary down here. So this guy died, but we're 100% here. We're not there. How about over here? We can't make headway. Let's go help. Come up here. We're 100% here. How are we here? We're 100% there too. Well, you can help here. You help here. And I tell you what, I think you'll probably be needed here. Yeah. Uh, public servant dying. Recruitment. Tons of men being recruited. Oh, that's in Norway. I've already looked at it. Awesome. To that. Monastery school. Get that iron workshop. Just a going. Get you. Down to here. That's everything else. Get the army board is the highest we can go. Yeah. That's good. Alright, we're fine. Um, Two away. Right there. We want to let these guys kind of get on the move. They'll get past. Um, we're waiting on one more click here. And as for you, you've got three more slots. Okay, great. And then he, they have to report in two turns over here. Once they get there, I'll give us a turn to settle. That's the turn that will get rid of our trade deal with them. So that'll happen all in the same time. Um, as far as these guys, I just really don't know why Poland has all these troops doing that. And they're at war with Spain, France, Maratha, and the pirates. I'm about to go to war with them too. I'm a little worried because they are allied to Great Britain, Venice, and Genoa. So I'm hoping that I have a big enough navy to handle things. Of course, here's, you know, you see the French over here with a pretty good sized navy. Like myself, I just need to probably come sit the navy up here. But we'll see. Um, actually, I bet you I can attack Corland. I attack Corland. That's all I got to do. Poland will probably come at that point. If not, I got a free I got free land out of the deal. Okay. Um anything else? Not this turn. Alright, let's end it and let's move on. Yep, those guys are moving onward to try to get over to Hanover and start converting it for me. They're converting other land along the way. Which is nice. It probably won't stick, but it, it's nice to have. All right. I should send those guys down there in the Middle East up to uh, Konigsberg. 
That's where they're really going to be useful. And Poland keeps pulling their troops back. Which is very interesting. Okay. Like they're pulling their troops away from me. Like they think I'm going to be nice to them for the rest of the game. That's not going to happen. Okay. Venice. Pirates. Okay. There we go. Lots of things getting done. Not sure what all that changes. So I have one great region here to take a look. I really don't think it changes anything. Um, like we just got quick lime, so that's kind of nice. He just finished the puddling, which gives me negative 10 recruitment costs for artillery, which would have known that. Um, yeah, and he just got the sextant done. Gives me more movement range for ships. Okay. We're going to go ahead up to the commercial basin. Water milled cloth. Denmark getting its uh, ordnance board. Dockyard here is as high as it can go. Yes, okay. Pull you in here. Are you a full stack army? You are. Go here. You are super close. Uh, you should be a full stack army. Minus one. What's the one? What 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 is this one missing? It's got everything, but it's missing one line infantry. Okay, and that must mean this guy's missing one too. It sure does. That's okay. I'm pretty sure somebody was screaming that that was a problem, but it's all right. It's not a big deal. If I delay one turn, I'm not going to be too mad about that. Or one extra turn, I should say. Okay. Just means that we get, you know, an extra chance to get ready to go. That's all. I'm more worried about that guy on the south anyway. And even then, that's not a very big worry. Okay. Poland is doing something with its troops. I think it took Brussels, but they're about to lose a ton here. Like the second I declare this war and I start beating him in the east, he'll start pulling troops back and he'll start running into like, he where he thinks he's ha okay, he'll start losing there. Yeah, he's going to be losing like his bread and butter provinces. Hessen. Okay. Come along. Alright. In Greece. This is really not that important for a place for him to be. So I'm going to send this guy up to here. Uh, school, or this church school to a seminary here. Or monastery, whatever it's called. Happiness of the nobility. Send you here. Now he should be in one turn able to get there next time. Maybe not, but we'll try. I want this guy to go right here. We can go through that guy's land right now. Go up to here. Go to here. We have our armies pretty much in place. You look good. You look pretty good. You look good. You look good. Um, from here, I don't know if I could keep going to that. Yeah, I need a little bit longer. I need one more turn. Yep, and you're good too. So we'll go bang, bang. Yeah, we'll, we'll hit them all pretty well. You should be able to go straight to Laval. There's nothing here to worry with. I just really want to grab it. Anything I can grab without losing troops and just taking the place I want to do. 
Uh, you're an agent, and I'm going to infiltrate you into there. Just get you up here for now. All right, we got one more turn. We're ending here. Next time, we'll be fully in locations where we need to be. All right, so you can see where they don't have hardly anybody in Berlin. I mean, it's working out for me in that regard. You know, Berlin, like the second that the, the bankruptcy and the war weariness starts up, they're going to start really wanting to give up and we'll see a Prussia form. Like, that's what we want to see. Okay. Oh, gosh. Did he just take out France? Oh, my gosh. This Poland has just taken out France. Or a French thing. I mean, the rebels will come. France has got one little territory down there. I'm just not quick enough to help out France. Okay. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct. Okay. Commercial port there. Elot gets its nice ceramics factory. Which ticks off the people a little bit, but... You know, I've never had that before, I don't think. Denmark gets that. We'll do this. Research-wise, yeah, we're coming along on all those things. I... Yep, you're there. Let's get you here. You're going to here. Um, these guys are almost where they need to be. Yeah, they have they're having serious problems. Okay. He's got to hold this. Like, he's already going to have a hard time here. No matter what he does, the Netherlands are coming back. So that's going to be helpful to us. The French are down here with plenty of Spanish nearby to help. Okay. As for us, Portland, cancel trade. Poland, cancel trade. No more trade deals. The power in Europe has definitely gone too far in Poland's favor for me. They now own three, four European capitals, like major European capitals. Five if you count themselves, but they own four they shouldn't own. Why I own, what, one, two, two, two major European capitals, I think, if you count Sweden and... Istanbul, you know, Ottomans, Istanbul. I mean, I guess if you want to throw that, like, the Persians are in there as another nation. And Denmark, yeah, okay. But if we do that for them, we're talking Saxony. We're talking, you know, Bavaria. I mean, they, they own everybody. Okay. Here we go. Come on. Get it over with, Poland. He's probably moving a ton of troops around. Let's see, I'm about to put him in a position. A trading at Poland and he wants me to pay for it? No. Nah. You can give me a whole slice of, you know, nations or something and we'd end this thing really early, but <laughs> that's not going to happen. Orthodox in Ukraine. You, my friend, are going to go up here. That. How's this look? Yeah, we've mostly got the Catholic, uh, Catholicism out of it. I think we're good to go. Um, let's see, natural causes of a general here. It's unfortunate that it's happening on the eve of battle, but it is what it is. An Orthodox missionary out here died. That's the guy who just moved in. Ah, uh, sad. Okay. This guy's 76. I mean, I'm just trying to give it a boost or something. Yeah, we're not getting what we need there. 
Over here, it's barely moving too. Let's move him down here. Point one. <laughs> Four more turns at that, we should be good. Alright, um, Denmark, that's a full-on fishery, we're great. Alright. And this is going up at 1.6, okay. This is going up at 2.7 and I want you to move out of the way a little bit. Alright, are, are we ready? Here we go, declaring war on Corland first. Poland joined. That makes it easy. I do not have to go to war against Great Britain. Unless they attack me. First army goes in here. And we'll be sieging this stack down. These guys are racing to Minsk. I'm going to demand they surrender. They will refuse. So I will siege him for now. This guy goes to Laval. Nobody's there. Demand it surrender. They will accept and we will... They are converting to... Yeah, Catholic. We need to get rid of anything. Catholics. This entire place is just really jacked up on that. We're going to send this guy to here to infiltrate into Warsaw. Spend the money here. As for you, you're going here there to are Transylvania. No troops stationed at this fort. I think getting rid of the... I don't think the fort's that big a deal. Game. Alright, we're in here. Everything's fine here. Fix this place. There you go. Go here. There we go again. We have a couple of docks... Not a major deal. Glacial estate. And we just have to hold here for a couple turns. No big deal. Um, three regions captured at the very start of this. That's how well that went. We're not even losing money. Like, at all. That's pretty great. Um, let's see. I do want to go ahead and attack here. 1626 against 285. There's no reason why we shouldn't attack. It's too easy. Let's go ahead and attack them. All right. I'm going to grab these guys here. That's all I need. Move forward. All right. And these two will move. Wish I could just easily do that. Like here. These two will move off over here. Okay. These foot guards are going there. You'll go there. You'll go there. You'll set up here. You'll set up here. There, there, two on the outside, these two are going to run now, we're going to speed up this battle a little bit, as for these, ready, 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 and rush, just going to speed it through this portion, there's no reason to really wait. Should be some easy, good experience at the beginning of the battle. I didn't do this right. I didn't keep an eye out for them. So here we go. Here we are. Yep. Rising to the top now. Go, 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 go. There we are. We've gotten the gate and we should close it on him. Actually, no, wait, we do not have the gate. Never mind. Climb. 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 
He's done lost three. Move him in. Move across. All right, he's lost 21. Six, he's down to 16 and he's down to 14. So we've done a pretty good job here. We've taken this here, I would assume. Here we are taking a position. If these want to take shots on him, they should. There it went. You guys are throwing up the lines. These guys are starting to come out, so maybe we can get some shots off and kill them. I need you to get up here as quick as you can. These guys are now getting up the top now. We have killed off all but seven of these. Two, five, fourteen, fifty-two. Here, these guys are doing a pretty good job of shooting them as they come out. We've taken two more locations on the wall. That wall has closed for them. Move up. Here's where the seven of these are. Taking up positions. These guys are down to three. Need you to get up here and fill in. Get these in here. Waiting on the walls to open. We're filled in here. He's down to one. Who's did the fight? Who did the fighting? This foot infantry did. Simonoski did a little bit. These guys got some rank. I would expect that they would too, but I guess not. It's down to one. Okay, I think we're held out here pretty fine. We're all coming inside. We're actually through the wall, through the door or the gate. I need you guys to turn and shoot quickly. They did a good job. We did two. We got down to two. up and fire kill the general Take a turn once you run in yeah this wall is fully, fully closed off so we we're going to kill all of them no matter what he's ready we'll toggle fire in advance if they want to do it Okay. But oh, they're gonna all have to reload, okay. Come on. We're holding here. We're definitely gonna get done in a minute and fifty seconds regardless of what happens here. Come on. Can you shoot? Here we go. Got quite a few. This guy's gonna walk through the line. 
Oh, they're shattered anyway. Alright, end it. Alright, we lost 53 to kill 285. Fix this. We do have the great roads already here. Need to send Poland a thank you letter for doing that for us. We get rid of all these seminaries. And we're going to fit in good buildings. That's what we want. Um, so we've already begun our first bits. We have come here and we have taken over this location. Oh, look here. I need to wait a couple turns. Not very many. I think, I, you know, once I get the first round of buildings completed, I should be able to walk. Um, here, he's staying for a minute. This guy is going to need to get these just deleted. I'm glad I went looking at it. Yeah, he's had to keep all these men here. Now, for me, I could hold here and be happy. And I probably will. So, for now, I'm going to hold right here. He's got another two here, like two armies stacked there. See, my idea would be these both come together at the same time. You keep on moving. Alright, he does have... He's not perfect here. He could start having some rebellious issues in his main city. He's doing better than me, though, but I have some war weariness. So, I've been at war forever. <laughs> but, uh, alright guys, I'm going to end it right here. When we come back, we're going to continue our attack. We'll probably deal with Corland then. We might be pushing on to Vilnius, um, which will help solve our front, uh, you know, a little bit of the front here. Um, we want to get to Konigsberg, or, you know, be surrounding Warsaw uh, with these troops. We want to be pushing on to Hungary and Vienna, I think. So, all right, guys, appreciate you all so much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell. Uh, comment, ask any questions, tell me anything you think I need to know. Uh, and also, if you are ready to see this war wind on down, go ahead and hit that like button. Smash the thumbs up, really does help with the YouTube algorithm and uh, shows more people, shows a lot of people that you like this video and that they should watch it too. That's how the YouTube algorithm works. So anyways, guys, I appreciate you all so much for watching. I'll see you all next time.